Well, Barry, I'm so excited about everything you've been telling me lately. It's a lot of really good stuff, and I hear you got something else for me. Yes, Honda Odysseys with the sliding doors. We're just going to go over a couple of small maintenance tips that can help you with your sliding doors, keep from sticking, having issues with them. Once again, if you do have any issues, please contact your sales associate, contact Michelle, That's me. <laughs> or contact the dealership ourselves, and somebody in service would be happy to help you out. With the sliding doors, because they have rollers on the top, on the bottom, and at the back of the door, it's important to keep them lubricated. Although every time you come in for service they are lubricated, sometimes it is important to do this periodically on your own to help the door. Um, Why is that important? How does it help the door? Just because the door itself is set up with a safety feature where is if it slows down for some reason, say an arm or something hits it, the door will back up or stop. So any kind of resistance from dirt, uh, hinges that don't move properly, all can slow the door down. The door will think it has an issue and won't close properly or won't open properly. So in that instance, sometimes lubricating either of the rollers, like at the top, there's one at the bottom, and there is a hinge at the back of the vehicle, also with a roller. Lubricating these with uh, products such as WD-40 can help the door in rolling properly. That's just the can you pick up at Walmart yes. for like a couple of bucks? Yes. It's also important to, to try and keep this track area down at the bottom clear of debris and stuff. Sometimes with small kids, toys fall in and stuff. Yeah. This can also cause different small issues with the door either opening or closing properly. Um, with winter conditions too, sometimes it's important to make sure that this area up at the top is free of ice and snow because if the door periodically sticks because of freezing and freezing and melting because of the vehicle heat and stuff, the door will per periodically stick and sometimes it's important to keep these clean and clear. I'm not letting you off that easy. <laughs> now when I clean my vehicle um, and I wash it myself, and I know you guys do it here for all our customers, but um, I do wash my own vehicle now and then and when I do I usually wash inside the grooves of the door and I'll wipe it down with the rag. Is that a, something that is I should be doing or not doing with the bottom of the rail? You could do that with the bottom of the rail periodically. Sometimes sand and stuff in there can cause issues with it and keeping like I said keeping it clear and clean is also a good idea even like cleaning in, inside the doors and stuff can help eliminate buildup of uh, grime and grease and road uh, debris and stuff, all of that stuff has an issue when the vehicles, like for uh, hinges and wow. latches and stuff, to keep them from coming up and keeping the door operating properly. And just make sure I re-oil them. Yes. <laughs> Thank you.